This is a quick tutorial to get you acquainted with the Juniper Secure Business Builder. The builder is broken down into four sections and progresses intuitively as you navigate through it. If you have just launched a page, be sure to click Agree and consent to the usage of cookies. In step one, fill in your company name and your interests for Juniper Financial Services. In step two, you begin designing your site types. Site types are defined as the number of installations that you would like to set up the same way. As you can see, you are provided with two pre-configured site types. Site A starts off with the Secure Business 50 package and one location utilizing it. Suppose you would like two branches to utilize the same setup. Then simply click and drag the bar handle to the desired quantity. Or double click and type in the number. Now you may only want to configure one site type. If this is the case, you can delete the other pre-configured one by clicking on the garbage can icon. You will then be prompted for confirmation. If you'd like to add a new site type, click on the appropriate icon here, and it will appear. For the purpose of this tutorial, we will only utilize one site type. Next, click on Customize Site Type. This will take you to Section 3. Here you have the ability to personalize your site type, further customize the locations, and see the simplified topology map for the locations. You also have the ability to change the current Secure Business 50 package to Secure Business 100, 200, and 500. As you can see to the right, your options can change depending upon the package you select. Pick the package that best suits the number of users at the desired location. So Secure Business 500 is great for a headquarter location with up to 500 users, while the Secure Business 50 is at the other end of the spectrum for use at a small branch for up to 50 users. For this example, let's call our site type West Coast Locations and select Secure Business 50 package. As you can see, you have many options to choose from in the Secure Business 50 package. If you are unfamiliar with them, click on the tooltip icon for a description. As you select the options you want, notice the topology map will change slightly by activating the appropriate icon. If you are unsure of what the icon is, click on it and the description will appear. After you are done selecting your options, you have four buttons to choose from. Reset Site Type. This will reset the settings for your current site type configuration. Save and Design Next Site Type. If you decide to work on your other site types or add new ones, clicking on this will take you back to Section 2. All done, download the proposal. If you are done and happy with what you have, you can easily click on this button for the chance to receive an instant proposal that provides the summary of what you have designed as well as the simplified topology and complete BOM. And the last option is continue designing later, which will supply you with your specific session URL to take you where you left off. Since we only have one site type, we will select all done, download the proposal. This will take you to a form to complete. Once you fill in the necessary fields and click on the submit button, the proposal will automatically start to download. This concludes the tutorial.